any other seriously right here Okay, so to do this effect, you need to download Google Earth Pro application. Link to download is in the description box below. Okay, now open Google Earth Pro. And now you can able to see our 3D Earth. And now here on the bottom left, you will see these layer settings. Simply uncheck all of them and just keep the terrain one here. Now go to the search box and write the place you want to go. I'm going to the Empire State Building. Now click on the search and it will take you to the location. So now we are at the Empire State Building and now you will notice this big red marker here. We need to remove it. So to remove it, just simply click here on the history and it somehow removes it. I have no clue how it does but it gets the job done. So yeah, just simply click on the history here. Okay now, zoom out to the 3D Earth and if you want you can also change the Earth tilt too if you want to. Okay now. Use a screen recorder and remember to record only this portion. Yeah, exactly this one. We don't need other portions so keep that in mind. Also to give more recording space, simply hold this border and drag it to the left to shorten it up. Okay now start the screen recording and then here click on this search result. And now you will notice that it automatically zooms to the location. Also remember that you need a good internet speed to pull this off, otherwise this will lag. So you need to have a good internet speed. Okay, so now once it is recorded, now stop the screen recording and simply head over to your Filmora. Okay, now once it's at Filmora, import the new recorded map video and here you can see our video. Now take this video and put it into timeline. And remember to keep the project setting to 1920 into 1080. Now right click on the video and click on crop and fill so that it will fill the screen perfectly. Ok so now I will go to the portion where I can see the clouds appearing and then at that portion I will split the clip and then I will delete the first portion because I don't need it that's why. Ok so now you can see that we are zooming to the building but it is very harsh zoom. So now we will add a fake motion blur into it. So to do that simply go to the effects tab into the utility section and now take this tilt shift circle and put it on the video. Now you will see this very harsh blurred out sides. So to ease them out, simply double click on the video and then go to the video effects and there change the intensity as per your liking. We can also increase and decrease the size of the blur radius too. It's our choice. And also let's put it at the center of our building. You have to adjust it according to your choice. So now if I play then you can see that it is giving our video that zoom motion blur effect. Even if it is a fake one, it still looks good. Ok now you will notice that when the video is stopping at the location, then this blur effect is still present. But we don't want that. So to counter that, simply at the point where the video is just about to stop, split the video and then double click on the last portion and then remove the tail shift circle from here. And now simply go to the transitions tab into the basic section and take this dissolve transition and put it between the two clips. Now let's render and play to check the final result. You can see that because of the transition it is now giving it a more organic look and the blur is also slightly fading organically. And yeah guys that is how our effect is done. Also some color grading will be useful to kind of give our video that more natural look. And guys that is how you do a map zoom effect. So guys what are your thoughts on this video? Let me know in the comment section below. And if you think that this video is worthwhile then hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that I can able to bring amazing videos just like this for you. Till then see you later.